Hi everybody, it's Pollo Del Mar. Want to find out how I've been getting my perfectly arched drag eyebrows of late? Stick around and I'm going to tell you the secret that was given to me by Lanesha Sparks of RuPaul's Drag Race Season 5 after this. But remember, subscribe to my YouTube channel and be sure to uh, follow me on Facebook and Twitter. You can find me on Facebook at facebook.com slash Pollo Del Mar fans and follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash the Glamazon PDM, as in Poya Del Mar. Of course, that's my name. At any rate, I'll be back in just a minute. I'm going to have my makeup already started and show you my inside secret to how I have been getting almost perfectly arched eyebrows lately. It's absolutely amazing and dirt cheap. Available at any of your local retailers, such as CVS, Walgreens, Walmart, or even Kmart. <laughs> Do this still exist? I'll be right back after this. All right, as you can see, we're back and I've got most of my foundation already applied. It looks really rough right now because I haven't blended it out, so just give me a break. We're gonna work on the eyebrows, all right? As you can see, I've already glued down my eyebrows. If you don't know how to glue down your eyebrows, um, follow the technique that I have in my YouTube tutorial on gluing down your eyebrows. You'll also see that I've covered most of my eye with the foundation color. It's a very light foundation color that I'm gonna be using but I haven't covered any of the, my actual brow. That's because I'm actually gonna be using my real brow in the technique I'm showing you. I have found a product that was recommended to me. It's so easy, it's like nine bucks. It is L'Oreal True Match Concealer. Now you can use this in a lot of different ways, but you're gonna see how I've now used a sponge to fill in all of this on my eye, but I'm actually gonna use this to draw the outline of the brow that I want to have. And even though there is no actual brow really out here, I'm going to just bring that out that's gonna create the shape of my brow. It's a lot easier to do this than um, in other ways. And if you get too much of this, you can just come along it with a sponge and here I'll show you. Oops. Come along it with a sponge using the same foundation color that you had underneath your eyes and blot it. You can just blend these two together See how nice that line is? Voila! Now, of course, we're gonna come along the top of it too because we're gonna do both brows, or both sides of the brow. This is really gonna create the, the shape that we're looking for here. Let's make it a little bit thinner, shall we? Let's. The top, the bottom, we're all good. Now I'm gonna come along it, we're like I just told you, take the sponge. By the way, all of these sponges are not created equal. These are from Target, I hate them, they're too spongy. The ones from Walmart, like this one, a little stiffer. It makes it a lot easier to blend, I think. Anyway, I digress. And then along the top, I'm going to buff this out into the highlight color that I've chosen. We'll come along the side over there. We don't want it too light over in the side, so I'm going to come along it with a dark just to put it back to the right color. And there we have the outline of what we're looking for for our eyebrow. It'll allow us a great, so easy to come through. Later on, we're gonna just come over it with a brush. I'm gonna use a little bit more right here at the corner. It's gonna be super easy. The best part about this is 
Remember how when you were in school and if you were writing a paper or whatever and you made a mistake and you could use whiteout over top of it? Well, when you're later on doing your eyeshadow, you can go ahead, when you're, if you're using powders or whatever you're using, say you make a mistake. Voila. It's flesh colored. Just come over it, white it out, and start over. Just swoop over it, blot it with your sponge, powder it down maybe. Presto. You're good to go. At any rate, I'll be back in a little bit to show you my final product. I hope this works out for you guys. Look at that. Five minutes. It could change the way you do your brows. So I'm back and as you can see I've done more work on my eyes and I'm not getting the results I want from the eyebrow shape. So here is that little trick I told you. We're going to take our True Blend concealer and I'm just going to come along the edge like white out. Look at that. And voila, I'm getting the eyebrow I want. Look at this over here. Don't love it. Okay, goodbye. And now the eyebrow is snatched, honey. Let's do the same over here. Make sure that a little bit more. See how much has changed things? Now, as I told you, just get a sponge, buff it out, top and bottom, and these brows are almost done. All right, everybody, this is the finalized look. Check out the eyes. The eyebrows are fierce now. Remember, it's as simple as a L'Oreal concealer. You can often get them, buy one, get one half off at Walgreens. Hey, you didn't expect all that. At any rate, remember, subscribe to my YouTube channel, follow me on Facebook, and follow me on Twitter. My name is Poya Del Mar. Until we're together next time, I'll see you guys soon.